Oh my gosh. Oh my God. Listen, Charleston White, man. Somebody get his, hey, listen. Somebody get Charleston White his flowers. All y'all ladies come, all the women come up here. Y'all want to know how y'all get y'all revenge on a man? I'm about, we about to give it to y'all right here. Charles White giving the game. He shut down all the feminist movement because the feminist movement ain't how you get revenge. Yeah, y'all want revenge on your man? Y'all check this video out right here, man. Well, honey. Understand the dynamic. Men want sex. Women want relationships. But like women give sex, still don't get relationship. Like, I don't. That's your fault. Well, let me just say this. That's it, our it, fault. It, it, it wasn't. <laughs> It, yeah, it, was, it, it wasn't hard for your grandparents, your grandmothers. Uh, they could get a man and keep him 20, 30 years. My uh, granny constantly talks about how much she got cheated on, though, and how well, unhappy well, well, she was. Well, there, there's, listen, there's, <laughs> she's smart. There's, smart. Not a, there's not a man alive that's not going to do that. Facts. There's not a man alive that you're going to get, and he's going to... He, there's not a man alive. Yeah, from what I'm seeing, yeah, for sure. Oh, uh, well... <laughs> do you think you're equal to a man? Me? Yeah. Oh my God! Why do you ask me that? Uh, well, I'm, I'm asking this because because uh, I want to ask you because the problem is that women understood their place back then. They understood that they were not equal to a man, and there were certain things that they just had to deal with to be with a man. But the problem is that with feminism, you guys think that you're equal to us, therefore you can do everything that we do. And the reality is, you can't. Just like her saying, "Oh, if you cheat, I'm gonna cheat back." You can't though. So the well, well, the yes, you can. The, well, well, here it is. The, the women before. We're gonna fuck other niggas. Listen, listen. The, the, <laughs> your, your grandmother's name. Even if, if if granddad was a whoremonger, grandmother still wanted to be a classy lady. Right. Mm -hmm, yeah. She just because her man was a dog that slept with everybody, she didn't want to compete with that. Right. Just because he's a dog don't You're make her be a like dog. The right. I'm not I'm not saying to okay, go and just do the same thing that he's doing. I'm saying you literally said that a second ago. Listen, no, 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 okay, matter, yeah. Listen, okay, look, saying, no matter what I did man, say that, no matter but what I didn't man, mean no, I didn't mean it like that. This, I meant it like I'm gonna be a little more open when guys come on to me. I'm gonna be a little more entertaining them. Well, as well, opposed well, here, to well, just well, being a loyal, a you know, well, 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 here's a right. the, the women, right, yes, the a women, the like women before you never not wanted to be a woman. No matter what her man does, she was still going to maintain the qualities and the dignity of a woman. Yeah. Even if she got hurt, if she got cheated, she never wanted to stoop how low her guy was. Today's yeah. women want to go as low as the guy. Yep. If the guy's a pervert, she wants to become perverted. I say, I say it's useless to even go and cheat on somebody that already cheated on you because then you're entertaining the relationship where it's toxic well here's the thing so, the woman the women before you never wanted to get her lick back her grace right. came from just being a woman even if she never cheated her revenge was Perfect. breaking up well she never wanted revenge because most stayed and her revenge was she kept loving him and his the, her love would shame him when, when he got sick, she would still take care of him, and he would be miserable knowing he'd done all this wrong to this woman, and she's still wiping his ass. That's where the punishment came. That is true. But did she stay because it wasn't at about, that time, it, it, wasn't, it, wasn't it about, wasn't about, listen, listen, listen. She stayed because she took a vow to stay that says for better or for worse. Yeah. She took the vow before God. Yeah. She took the vow before her mother, her father, and all these people that mm -hmm. was in the church. It wasn't about what he did. It mm -hmm. was about her maintaining no, her vows. but back then, she was more or no, solely no, 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 listen, dependent no, no, on no, her listen, husband. No, 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 she wasn't. No, no, she wasn't. It, 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 listen to what I'm saying. I'm saying, like, financially, no, like, no, no, in that no, listen, household. Listen, listen, listen. Mo most women, because he broke her vows, mm -hmm. she still maintained hers. It wasn't about that he was still taking care of because most men came home and gave the woman all the money. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He kept enough to drink and cheat with and mm -hmm. gave her all the money so she could pay the bills. Facts. Most men in that time didn't pay bills. He gave her the money and she paid the bills. Mm -hmm. She went yes, grocery shopping. But it's not her money. But this is what it was about. I took a vow before God mm -hmm. and this vow is a covenant. I'm not breaking this covenant because my husband cheated. She wanted to maintain her dignity even though her husband didn't. Mm -hmm. She wanted to maintain her vows. Her 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 pride came in saying, I never broke my vows. He did. Tell him, OG, tell him. T today's <laughs> women want to get even. Preach. The women before you didn't want to get even. She got even by not doing wrong to you. And in the process, you felt horrible as a man. Facts. Mm.
you stop cheating, you stop lying, you start confessing your wrongs to this woman because you saw her do no wrong. That's how you beat the man. Mm. That's how you beat him. Listen, listen here, y'all. If Charleston White didn't just get these women the game, how to keep a man and how to get your man to be honest with you and stop cheating on you. This is, he just gave y'all the game. And why I think this will go over a lot of women's head is because y'all don't got it in y'all. Y'all think by doing exactly what this, that ain't going to help y'all. You going, you going, your man cheat, you going to go cheat. Listen, and you going to go fuck with a lot of women. For one, y'all can't keep up with a man's sex drive. Y'all can't go down here and, and, and have sex with as many men as as a man has sex with as many females. That's one. That ain't going to be done. And at the end of the day, you're not a lady then. You're not a woman. You're not a classy lady how these other women back in the day. Y'all be talking all this stuff, right? Oh, they didn't. They didn't. Them women back then didn't have nothing. Them women back then was dumb. No, the heck they wasn't. We see they had way more value. They're way valuable than these women nowadays because why? They died with a husband. They died in a relationship. Y'all women nowadays or with this single feminist movement from the 80s on up, 70s. My mom was born in 55, and she never had a man in the household. So y'all sitting here saying them women back in the 50s and 60s need no. Y'all talking, we talking about, you must be talking about the women that was growing up at that time. The women that was already grown in the 50s and 60s. But the women that was born in 50s, 60s, no, they came in this movement where they had a lot of assistance and a lot of help. So they really didn't need a man. That's why that stuff came where make it feel like y'all don't need a man. But at the end of the day, your value is based on your family, not your job. Not your job. Meaning that your job and you having this money, this that, that don't mean nothing. Where is the husband? Where is the family together? And the women back then had had family. They had their husband. They had the whole family coming together. Now y'all just breaking up the family. Ain't nobody know nobody. You know what I'm saying? Everybody against each other. Is everybody for themselves? Oh, that ain't my business. Oh, I don't care. That ain't my child. Oh, it didn't happen to me. It is. That's them. That ain't us. That's the problem right now, bro. That's y'all issue, and y'all want to be so much like the men, and y'all, it just ain't going for y'all, man. It ain't going for y'all. And at the, at the end of the day, y'all got to remember, y'all raising all these feminine niggas, man. Y'all got to stop doing that. These men is coming out the blue, left to right, out of these single-parent households, feminine as ever. I see it, I see it, I see it, and I ain't lying. I'm keeping it a hundred. So, ladies, man, y'all want to get revenge at your man? Stay solid and pick the right guy. Pick the right guy. Stop having uh, uh, babies by all these different men, man. Y'all got to stop doing that. Because at the end of the day, you cannot be a king, a queen to a king when you already been a concubine. Straight up. But like I said, man, I'm gone, man. I appreciate y'all rocking with me, man. Make sure if y'all ain't did it already, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Definitely do me that favor, man. Also, follow me on the gram, man. It's going down. But like I said, man, oh, yeah, I'm going to start going live on the gram, too, because I don't be going live. I don't be really posting on the gram, but I'm going to start going live. I'm just trying to wait till it get up a little bit more. So, y'all, man, I appreciate y'all rocking with me, man, fucking with me, man. Like I said, y'all, it's your boy 2700, and I'm gone. I heard the shots, I say they run the city. I heard Super J say he ain't fucking with me. I heard your star say he king of the city. Heard they say they looking for me, shit didn't come and get me.